G'day. I don't know if you've tried to download your photos from Instagram, but it's not very easy. You can't do it uh, directly from the site unless you want to take a screenshot. And they're your photos, so you might as well have them. So you need to go to this site here, instaport.me, uh, or just uh, Google download Instagram photos, and it will be the first one that comes up. Now, you're going to need to authorize your Instagram account uh, to be accessed by Instaport. Um, you know, if you're concerned about the sort of ramifications um, of doing something like that, you should Google that. Um, okay, so uh, go to download a zip file. I'm only, you can download all your photos, but I've got a ton up there, so I'm only going to download five, um, just so it doesn't take too long. So once you've you know, selected a few options, click Start Export, and away you go. I'd go and make yourself a cup of coffee, especially if, like me, you had a lot of photos up there. Um, it might take a uh, little while, um, but uh, when it's done, it's extremely worth it to have all your Instagram photos on your own computer. Now, this is the where you download it from. You can donate and download, or just download only. So today, because I'm doing a tutorial, I'm just going to download only. So it'll take a while depending on how many photos you got up. I only downloaded five, so it was fairly quick. But just go to the Finder while well, I'm on a Mac. Or, you know, just go to, I don't know, what do you call it on Windows now? File, Finder, whatever. Click on uh, the zip file uh, and extract it. And there you go. There's your Instagram photos. Have a great day and I'll talk to you tomorrow.